Hello everyone, my name is Brendan Grimlock Mitchell here, and today we are back with another video. And this one is... Hold on, let me get that out of the way. Yes, yes. I tried to make this video earlier the other day, but it didn't work. Let's just say that. We had technical difficulties. So... I restarted the game, and today we are going to be playing a game called uh, The Last Day on Earth. This is a really fun new zombie game. It's one of my favorites. Anyways, it's one of my favorites, and uh, it's really good. Man, I, I just woke up. I can't think, guys. Anyways. Let's get right into it. I hope you like the content. I am not going to promise a series because it seems like I can't, can't finish a series. So, if you guys like it and show enough support, I will do a full series. And I mean it this time, but I need support on this. So, anyways, we're going to go to server one. We are going to do that come out oh it takes a lot of load I guess there we are here we are Let's, we can turn that up a little anyways so first thing you do is you go to your inbox and you take your three bottles of water and three big beans second thing you learn the, you don't actually need to learn that just yet, but, so, we'll save our points. Then you go to this whole peek up, and you take that, that, we equip that, and that. Now we have a weapon. And now, we have to collect wood and stones so that we can build hatchets and pickaxes to collect more wood and stones. Alright, that should work. Now, we go into crafting. I am not going to narrate it this whole time, by the way, guys. I will do commentary. I will not. Uh, what's it called? Narrate. Yeah, I will not narrate the whole time. It's already dark. Jesus Christ. I need one more stone so I can make a hatchet so I can get some more wood. There we are. There's already zombies? Usually there aren't zombies in the homeland. So what we do to these guys is we chop off their stupid little faces. Oh, sorry if it's a little laggy, guys. My phone's plugged in. Let me undo that. There. Jesus. These are the most zombies I have ever seen in this area before in all my time of playing this. Which is only a few days, but I mean, I was pretty shocked. Oh, we do, however, need some deer meat, and the deer is over here. Yes, sir. Freak up on this guy. Jesus Christ. How many zombies can there be in one area? We're just going to leave that alone until we're a little bit stronger and back. Alright, we can make the hatch yet. And let's start cutting some trees, guys. Yep, you don't cut trees with a butcher's knife. Your first objective is to build a base in this area. I am in terror. 
Hey. Hey, thank you. Thank you. It wasn't responding to my movements. How's my inventory full? Yeah, I can fit more wood. What are you talking about? Deforestation of this area is completely necessary. I've never seen so many trees in this area before. It's nice to know that it's randomly generated. Everybody's given. Uh, well, no one's given a fair advantage. I don't like that. Some people have the same stuff as other people, and that is just fine by me. It would be very helpful if you could stop freezing game while I'm doing the video. Alright, is there still some yachts over here? As soon as I hit this guy, there was a rock and roll. Okay, now we're loaded up. Well, the first thing that we need, we need a campfire. We need, we don't need the backpack yet, actually, because you'll get a backpack in the next area. Something's coming. This is an online game, guys. If you were wondering. So, anyways, we don't need to learn the backpack just yet, because we'll find one in the next area. Uh, well, we can't learn the worm catcher yet, so we are going to learn the garden bed and the small box. That's then we're going to find an area for our home. This area is really off from the last one that I that I played. So ah, here, here will be our area. Okay, so you don't need crafting recipes for these. Look at this, this is the biggest base I've ever, ever had playing this game, honestly. Uh, this one here. By the way, if you ever need sufficient XP, literally just go out collecting wood, stone, and whatever comes off these kelp like looking thing and it is, hey, I'm not allowed to not pick you up anymore. Actually, 
I'm going to eat this dinner meat. Um, to talk to you about. Thank you. Plant fiber, that's what you get for me. Anyways. Uh, hey, you can't be low already. Only a 10 minute video. I do for a reason. So close. And by the way, the roof auto builds, so you just need to go find some more wood. There's a the tree. No. Go on the side of the tree if you want to be doing that crap. Thank you. Do -do -do. Just look at this. Oh, hold on. Bam. Roof. Told you. Okay. Anyways. We now have a base of operations. What we need next is to build a small chest. No. Actually, we build the campfire first. So, now we get to leave. What time is it, though? Oh, it doesn't tell me. Um, I'm gonna plug this in, so if it gets a little laggy, I'm sorry. Uh, this is a mobile game. That's why I love it so much. I usually dislike mobile games, but this one is one of the best mobile games I have ever seen. Um, hold on, guys. I'll get back to you in a minute. There we are. I was just fixing something. Anywho. Oh, yeah. What were we doing? Oh, yeah. We're going this way. As soon as you hit the green area. You go to the global map. And the global map lets you. Well, it does what it says. It shows you where to go. Oh, my stuff start to be hungry. Could you load? Maybe? Thank you. We go to this forest. This is an energy-based game. You don't have to use your energy. It's just very helpful. Otherwise, it takes a long time to do anything. And when I'm making a YouTube video, I have to use energy. Because I can't sit here for 12 minutes. Because that's a 12-minute walk right there. When I can just run there in 5 seconds. Bam. I got fast. I'm fast. Run there in five seconds versus walking there for 12 minutes. I think you know what I'm gonna do. Alright, so for the campfire, we need basic stuff. Oh, yeah, and there's other survivors. And there's other survivors will hunt you down. I don't like other survivors. Now we have a backpack, we can store more stuff. Alrighty, and the next thing I'm going to do, if I remember how to, yeah, that's it. I want to put these in my pocket so I have quick access. I stripped him bare. 
you got to crouch everywhere you go. Because you can see on the edge of that map there, that little red dot. If I walk any closer to that, that is a zombie facing my direction. I know it's a zombie because it's not moving. If it was moving, it might be a zombie, but more likely to be a, uh, another survivor. Because this is an MMORPG, if you don't know what that means, it's Mass Online Multiplayer Role-Playing Game. No, it's Mass Multiplayer Online Role-Playing Game. Sorry. Equipment chest. I'm going to drink that, actually. You need to save your bottles of water. Stay away. You was running on man. Did you use? There we are. But anyways, I need to get back to the task at hand and stuff. Grading stuff. Because I need an inventory space. And if I could just find some stones, that'd be great. Thank you. I, my hatchet broke, I need a new hatchet. You're hungry, boo-hoo. Fine, I'll feed you. Baked beans. Have some baked beans. Jesus Christ, what is that? Great work, great work. All I heard, usually you can, you know, be ready, because you can hear things coming. That thing ran up on me. That's a good thing you did, though, because I need food. Don't do that again. God, in my heart. And then we are always in the shower. Shower is useful. You have to shower. No joke, you have to shower. You have to use the bathroom. You have to do normal everyday things in this game. And I like that they took that into account because you'd have to do that stuff. IRL, I mean, you can't go around in a zombie apocalypse without a shower. You could, but it would be gross. So, that drops. I know there's some trees over there, but there's more trees over here and more zombies. So, I appreciate that. For that red dot, guys. Come on, I see you zombie. Watch for that red dot, because usually cutting down trees makes noise. Noise, as you know, as you just witnessed, attracts zombies. Oh God, this is already an 18-minute video. Jesus. No, we are not. I need... A good tactic, tactic in this game, I know it sounds like something a wimp would do. Run. Just trust me. Run. Because there are zombie hordes everywhere. See, look at this. Three zombies. Oh god, oh god, oh god. See what I mean? Look at that zombie. That's a Roman zombie following me. You can tell by his speed. He won't stop following me either. So, we're gonna make a run back to our base. See, that's a faster zombie. That's a fast fight. But luckily, as soon as you reach the global map area, you're dead. 
Alright, I'm gonna make it back to the base. I'm gonna build the campfire and I will end off the video. Crashed plane. I don't have enough space for that. I'll show you guys a crashed plane. As well. I just gotta empty out some of my stuff. Electronic parts will come in handy when assembling a radio and other electronical devices. Don't throw them away. It is currently 6.24 in the afternoon. Or morning. I mean, we even have our own lamp for you guys. How is a deer in my house? I don't know, I don't care. I'm going to chop his face off. Shouldn't be in my house. No, it is. Great, now there's going to be a freaking deer in there at all times. Anyways, uh, we need to build a small box. If I'm going to show you the thing that There Here, go to furniture. That. Put it in that one. We don't need a tire. We don't need rope. We don't need scrap metal. We don't need this electronic. We don't need this water bottle. We don't need those at all. I don't know. I believe you need the army badges to get into bunkers, that's why I keep the army badges. We need the wood. Reorganize a bit. Alright, on that note, let's get to it. Hey, it would be great if you would stop that. Let's go check out a plane crash before anybody else gets there. Because usually they're full of other survivors, and other survivors tend to be more leveled than you. And then you get dead. And you don't like to get dead. Trust me, it's not fun. It's very aggravating. Alright. I'll show you what a plane crash is. We're next to. Jewel. Huh. Hopefully Jewel is offline. City ruins. They say there are huge city ruins to the north. To this day, thousands and thousands of zombies roam the street of this former glorious place. This map, guys, I'll show you in the next episode, is huge. And I mean it when I say huge. Alright, this is a plane crash. That's exactly what you would expect. Takes a while to access bags. Or if you want those. Hey, hey, hey! Said we want that. So we just can't. We don't want the bag. We need some bolts. got a crouch, there you go, because, uh, people, you can get this ability that lets you sense people. So. Mm, bacon. We don't need 
Brasil. We're rating everything it is before I start that video or this video. So. There's lots of stuff. You always want to go to these plane crashes and also the humanitarian ch uh, drops that come. The humanitarian drop ships. Did I access that? No, I did not. Highly doubt we need to go watch. Highly. Bucket of beans. You can build motorcycles in this freaking game. Guys. You always want to collect everything that you think would be useful. Oh, do we have space? No, no. We oh, yes, we do. Alright, we're going to grab one of the cell phones. It wasn't this one, was it? Alright guys, let's get out of here and I'll end off with this 30 minute video. Always go to phone crashes. I'm going to just let my guy walk back because, you know, I'm going to be done playing this after the video. So... He can just do whatever he wants because it's only like, what, a 50 minute walk. Alrighty, guys, let's get this walk home started. 24 minutes. Anyways, guys, my name is Brendan Grimlock Mitchell. This has been The Last Day on Earth Survival. It is an MMORPG, so if you guys do like the video and want me to continue making more of this series, that uh then tell me down in the comments and the like section also if you guys want to play with me go ahead and join up i don't uh you would have to join on server one what is that what i've never seen these things before huh anyways uh go ahead and join up on server one so y'all can meet or we all can or by the time uh, you, oh my god, I can't speak. By the time you guys actually see this video and get everything up, I should have a clan started because you need a communications tower for a clan. So as soon as I make a communications tower, y'all can join my clan and we can play together. Or if you want to create an opposing clan and fight me, you can do that. Just let me get a higher level, please. I am a very sore loser. There's islands? Jesus Christ. Anyways, 
My name is Brandon Grim. Oh, I cannot speak. My name is Brendan Grimrock Mitchell. This has been Last Day on Earth Survival. Like, comment, uh, share, and smash that subscribe button. I'll see y'all next time. Peace out.